Hi, this is Jared from ShoeGnome, and today I want to do a quick video on importing SketchUp objects into ARCHICAD. Um, there's two super simple ways to do this, so I thought I'd show you guys. Um, so step one is you go to the uh, sketchup.google.com or Google you know, SketchUp warehouse um, and type in an object you want to find. So today's example we're going to do the Noguchi coffee table which is the greatest coffee table in the world. So I did that. This is what comes up. I'm just going to randomly pick one of these. I'm going to go with this one because it says download for SketchUp 8. That means to me that this is a newer object so uh, hopefully it's better done than maybe some of these other ones. So I'm going to click on that and then, okay, there's the object, it looks nice and pretty. I'm gonna go download model. Download it. It's gonna give you an option. <laughs> I've already done this. Basically, it's gonna default to SketchUp, but you can go other. You know, go scroll down and find, uh, go to Graphsoft, choose your ARCHICAD version, select that, hit open. Now it's gonna just open in ARCHICAD 17. I could click do this automatically which might be good because I don't use SketchUp, I use ARCHICAD. But anyways, I've set open with ARCHICAD, 17, hit OK. Now ARCHICAD is opening it. Pause for a moment as it's converting. And we're done. Like literally, that's it. Just find it on the internet, click open in ARCHICAD and you're all set. There's the table. Oh, love this table. Um, we can now open this object, see you know, if there's any parameters in there. There's not much. Um, at this point, you could use it as it is. Or, uh, let me pause. At the end of this video, I'll add some links to two other object videos I did that will talk about how you could take this turn it into a morph, save it as another object, do all sorts of other things to it, add a subtype, but literally that's it. Um, now if you already have the object already and you've saved it, or you're adding it to an existing file, another thing you can do, grab the file on your desktop, whatever folder it's in, and just drag it into ARCHICAD. Just drag and drop like you would a PDF. Um, it's going to convert, and we're going to wait. Now there's the object, we're just placing it. And there it is. So we can either download it directly from the website, we can drag and drop it. If we go to File, uh, Libraries and Objects Library Manager, we're going to see both those there. They're embedded uh, into the file. And we're done. So it's literally that easy to bring in any number of SketchUp objects into ARCHICAD. Uh, one last thing, um, remember when you're bringing in outside content to check the number of um, polygons, because uh, you can get some really big objects that shouldn't be big. So do that, window, palettes, go down to polygon, and count, and we can see here it's listing everything. Um, I've got a, I'll put a link in the description or in the blog post, I have a post about poly count add-on. But here we are, uh, the Noguchi coffee table, 6,000 polygons. It's not bad. It's not bad at all. So, um, that's the video for today. I hope you learned a new trick and we'll start mining the SketchUp warehouse for all sorts of objects to dump into your ARCHICAD files. And now I'm going to leave a little blank space here and I'm going to put up some links so you can get to my other videos on object creation which will take uh, the things you download from SketchUp warehouse to the next level. Thanks.